Well, occasionally you've got to start cleaning your tools. And I've gone through and separated all my tools that I have. And I've put ones that I very seldom use into a jar. And I'm going to clean these right now. I've got to throw away a rag because this gets a lot of uh, clay on the uh, material and it kind of ruins it. I got uh, Todd Connor and another artist friend coming over today uh, and uh, I'm just uh, doing this to keep busy this morning and then I'll work on this uh, clay this afternoon, finish it up and uh, get ready to start back on something different. I thought I'd go back to my horses. I had an idea for uh, doing my horses and uh, I'm just going to do this today. Just use a flame and it melts the clay. Your tools like new. This is a, a glyptic tool. If I wanted to, I've got a ton of different shaped and sized wire ends that I could put on this thing. Um, all I gotta do is loosen this little Allen nut and it loosens the head and I can uh, take it out. It's made so strong that I'll tell you, you could use these for years and I have been using this for a couple of years. And nothing uh, will break because uh, if it does, you spend a couple of dollars for a brand new uh, wire end and uh, very, very cost effective if you're a sculptor to have good, strong tools that you can get used to. And uh, if you're constantly having to replace a tool for $20, $30 for a wooden handle tool like this one, and I just put out the uh, light. There we go. Light it right back up. Anyway, um, as I was saying, before my light went out, if you have to replace a wooden tool, and this is a lot longer tool than what it looks like here, because I always cut them down, because if you have to work under something, having a long tool does not work. Metal tools, uh, wire tools, the glyptic tools, all from uh, Sculpture Depot .net. Good people, they carry everything you can imagine that you need as a sculptor. Everything they, uh, that you would ever need as a sculptor, Sculpture Depot has. Uh, super sculpty, whatever they call that clay. And uh, silicone and all that material. Every type of clay that you can imagine, uh, ceramic and uh, plastiline, which I use. They even carry armatures. Now I know I've shown uh, true form armatures here. Occasionally, they may have a true form armature in stock. But you'd kind of like to have to ask for it because uh, it's been spotty getting the uh, supply of true forms. But if anybody has them, it'll be them. And if they don't, they'll let you know. Alright, I'm just going to keep on playing with my tools and cleaning them, and I'll see you guys next time. Give me a thumbs up and share my video. And then check out my instructional DVDs, uh, the link down below this video. 
All right. See you next time.